Hi guys, I just want to show you um, how I tried to remove the heat stamp initials from a Louis Vuitton Neverfull. Um, these are gold uh, initials and I was told to use alcohol prep pads and I got these from Walgreens for four dollars I think and it comes with 200 so yeah you're gonna need a q-tip and the alcohol pads so this is my first time doing this I am going to try it uh, I don't know if it's okay to tag luxury lover uh, it was her idea she gave me the tip and I appreciated because I'm even though if it didn't work um, if it doesn't work then I'm still uh, gonna exchange or replace the straps so um, thank you luxury lover for giving me this tip and what I did is I grabbed one of the uh, alcohol pa prep pads and I got my cute my q-tip uh, and I started uh, gently rubbing the initial and it does take a while it took me about an hour and you do have to let it dry in every time you stop and use a new um, a new alcohol pad then you give it time to soak in there and it it didn't leave a stain but it did leave a different color but um, you guys are going to be able to see it. So this is the first um, prep alcohol pad. And I will show you how many I used because I did it gently at the beginning and then I stopped. I let it breathe and then I did it again. I gave it time to soak in so that the uh, gold lettering would soften up and start peeling um, so it did it did take me a while and because you know you have to wait till it dries and then start all over again um, but I'll show you here in the video uh, what I did So you keep uh, rubbing the initials so I went to one and then I went to the other one and then I went back to the same one and then you know I, I just switched and let it soak and soften up so here's the next one this is number two and the um, the Q-tip does help uh, to scrub. You can, I've seen people do it with their nails as well. I've seen this before and it, I guess it depends what kind of heat stamp they used at the Louis Vuitton or I have no idea, maybe they did it somewhere else. Um, but yeah it looks a bit dark right now and it will make like a dirt line outline but what i did after i removed the um the gold initials i started uh to use uh new prep pads and i gently rub the whole thing on there um, on the whole outside except for the the strap I didn't go up there so this is number three 
the number three one. So I did use like about 20 of these alcohol prep pads, just so you know. And I will show you how many I opened. So I think this one's the third one. And as you can see, it is removing them. And it does not leave this dark stain. It dries out very, very quick. I kind of forward it because it was a pretty long video. It did take me about two hours, one hour and a half or two hours. But it's because you have to wait till it dries and then start doing it again. So yes, you have to be patient and scrub, let it soak for a little bit and then come back and, and uh, scrub. Okay, so this is number five. So yeah, I think I lost count. I think it's number five. Also, make sure you use your glove. Uh, you don't want to mess with the alcohol. Uh, hopefully, you know, you're not... It doesn't bug your fingers. So, just make sure you wear a, um, a glove. A textile glove. So, then, what I started doing is... I removed the alcohol prep pad and I started using a Q-tip to go all over the, all over the the area there. So here I go again. And then after this, you can see it's drying out really quick. But after this, I open another alcohol prep pad and I started all over again and I did this several times I would let it dry and then I would go back and use a new uh, alcohol prep pad so you can see it's almost dry and it did leave that dirt outline I don't know what what kind of it is but you're supposed to use another alcohol prep pad and um, what I did I just used it on the whole area because I didn't want that black line around <laughs> that black line in a circle it's a bit annoying to see those stains and you can see there's a different color in the middle where I kept scrubbing. But what you can do is after, you know, now it's dry. And after you get another alcohol prep pad and start cleaning the rest of it. Um, what you can do is after you're done, if you see that's a very, very light color, pale color then you would condition it or spray some of that apple guard so it protects the vichetta so there i let it dry and then i used another alcohol prep pad i went over it again so that that stain would not stay there um I don't know, uh, I thought, you know, it's, it's going to remove the, um, the initials, but it does not remove the, um, the outlining of the, or the print, it'll remove the gold. But the, the shadow or the, 
the print still stays stays there so so yeah and this is the final product and you what you can do is you can go ahead and do it again and again until you like and then so yeah thank you for watching oh here you guys here is you can see these are all the ones i use and what i did uh you know just follow the instructions if you want to go ahead and do it i wouldn't recommend it unless it's okay with you if your purse is not that old i mean not that new okay thank you for watching bye bye